Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anna. If you're new here, I do makeup reviews, makeup tutorials, skincare, anything beauty related. I got you covered. So we're going to talk about two pretty viral products. I'm seeing this all over my feed. It's the Pixi On The Glow. Today we're going to do the Bronze Glow. I have two. I have the darkest shade, which is Beach Glow, and then I have the lightest shade, which is Warm Glow, which my friend Laura actually gave this to me. Um, cause she bought it and she's like, yeah, it doesn't work for me. And I was like, I'll take it because my idea is this is not going to work for me as a bronzer. And I know that, but as a highlighter, it's not bad. It's, it's pretty. We're going to do some swatches. We're going to put it on. I am in the process of a wear test. So keep your eyes peeled for when I do upload the Maybelline Super Stay Vitamin C. 24 hour skin tint, um, quick story, I'm reviewing shade 120. I have a few coming in different shades, but I really wanted to get that out to you guys. But anyways, back to Pixie. So, I have these two, they're super viral, they're super cute. Um, I do like these, and when I talk about the blushes in another video, you're gonna be like, yeah, and I can tell you really like them because you bought all of them. It's a good formula. Flat out, it's a very good formula, it's convenient, it's user friendly, It's freaking awesome. So let's start off with some swatches. And really quick, if you're not subscribed, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you know when I upload videos. Let's let's talk about makeup together. It's my favorite thing to do. All right, let's just do some quick swatches. Like I said, two shades only. There's a shade I believe in between, maybe one or two shades. I just, when I saw it, I was like, I don't think it's gonna work for me, so I never got it. So, let's do, this is the Beach Glow. It's a beautiful bronzy color. It has a little bit of like a copper undertone. I wouldn't say it's like super red, but you know, it's bronzy, it's gonna show up on my skin. And then I have the, the Warm Glow. The Warm Glow, I don't think it would be a bronzer on me. It's almost like a blush. It's like peachy on me. I don't think it's really going to do much, but I like it as a highlighter. So let's try this on. I see people doing a couple of different things. I see people going like this and applying it. I don't like to necessarily do that, but you know what? For the hell of it, for the video, the review, let's just put it on that way. I will show you the way I like to put it on, but just kind of go like that. And I'm going to take a brush and I'm just going to blend. So again, that is Beach Glow that I am putting on my cheek. Should we try the light one on the other side just to see if it does anything? We can. Let's see. I know I'm like, oh, it's a highlighter, but... So people kind of do that. I think if you're doing it on bare skin, definitely go for it. But you know me, I'm going to use my fingers. I'm going to just pop that on top. We are going to pop some on my forehead because the foundation that I have on today is just a teeny bit light. And I'm gonna just blend with the brush. I need a bigger mirror, I can't see. I don't know about you guys, but I am nearsighted so I can't see far. And even though like the viewfinder is probably about a foot and a half away from me, I can't see for my life. It's really pretty. All right, let's try this one. This is Warm Glow. Let's just see what happens. I never put it on my cheeks the way I did this one. Oh my god, I feel like I, <laughs> I'm i going to prove myself wrong right now. This is actually... It's it's giving glow and a little warmth. Not like a bronzy, you know... Is it? Do you guys think it looks like a bronzer? I don't know. No, see on my forehead, it's like a peach. On my cheek, though, it's like a really pretty... Blush? Again, I think it's more of like a blush topper. Um, warm glow, beach glow. This is the deepest one. This is the lightest one. I think on somebody who's fair skin, like fair skin, you burn in the sun. This might actually be a good bronzer for you because it does mimic like that little peachy pinky tone. Um, on me, it's kind of just giving my cheek a glow. Super pretty. All right, let's, let's even this out real quick. I'm going to just do this. So on this side, it's going to be a combination of both colors. I'm going to take this and just different 
way to apply it. You can take it from the brush onto the actual bronzer. This color is really beautiful. Guys, if you are about my skin tone, my undertone, go for the Beach Glow. I think you're going to like it. So these, they, okay. I don't find them tacky. I know some people said that they're tacky and some people said that it's a very interesting um, texture. I do want to remind you guys that I have dry skin. So I need moisture. These don't feel like sticky, tacky or anything like that. It actually feels really nice. It goes into my skin. It has enough pigmentation to warm up my skin tone as well, which you know I love because I needed a bronzer and I try not to sit outside in the sun. I always have SPF on. So I feel like this looks like I was outside. Um, again, uh, this one, the Warm Glow, I like it. Let me see something. I'm going to put some on my eyelids because this you can do your lips, your cheeks, your eyes. I'm going to take some and I'm just going to pop some on my lid. It's pretty. It does tint the skin a teeny bit. So obviously if you put it on the eyes, it's going to probably crease a bit because it has like an emollient texture. It's really pretty. I have a lip mask on right now. I really want to put this um, bronzy shade on my lips because I want to see what it looks like. So I'm going to take it, pick some up. It's like a sheer color, so... Ah... That's really pretty. It just tints the lips ever so lightly. Or slightly, lightly. How does it go? Ever so slightly, ever so lightly. I don't know. Um, it's pretty. And it leaves a really pretty glow to the skin. I like it. These are good. If you were on the fence about these, I'm telling you they're totally worth it. Uh, you can get them on Target. I believe you can get it on their website. These tend to vary. I've seen them between $18 to $21. It's probably more affordable if you actually go in store and get them. Um, you probably order them on their website. They do have them on Amazon, but Amazon is charging like $30 for this, which I think is a little bonkers if you ask me. Um, sometimes it's better just getting it from Target. Uh, so yeah. Definitely, definitely like these. Easy to use. If you're afraid of cream, uh, bronzers, or anything like that, do not worry. I promise you these are a piece of cake to use. So don't worry about that. Um, yeah, try them out. I will have them linked down below if you want to purchase through there. It's an affiliate link. Um, I know it's charged to you, but it definitely helps out the channel. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you in my next one.